everybody, Kathy Hedrick Anderson here today and um, I had a client that asked me how come I advocate that everybody wears a helmet and I myself don't wear one. Well, it's not, that's not 100% true. I do wear a helmet every time I go off farm and work with other people's horses because uh, there's a higher risk of me getting injured getting on somebody else's horse that I don't know and of them bucking, rearing, bolting. I try to do my preparatory work to make sure that's not going to happen. I don't get on if that horse doesn't stand to be mounted. Uh, I wore a helmet when I first started my youngsters, but I put in countless hours in, of training into my horses and we still live in this free country that it's my choice, my right to do what I want to do at my own place. On the other hand, when you come to my farm, I will require that you use a helmet because we live in a litigious society. Um, also, I have everyone sign a release, my insurance company, and uh, the state of Mass kind of requires it. I'm a mass license instructor and I do want beginners to wear a helmet. Um, you, they don't have good balance, they're not prepared, um, and so that's going to help protect them. Um, it's not going to protect you 100%. Um, their horseback riding is inherently dangerous, if I didn't already say that, and um, you really need to put in the time uh, and also you don't ever want to get on a horse that does not stand still to be mounted, okay? If you go to take lessons somewhere and somebody needs to hold that horse's head for you to get on it, please don't get on it, okay? If the horse looks excited, he's jigging, he's uh, spinning around, please don't get on it, okay? And I'd appreciate if you don't give me a hard time for it's my choice okay not to wear a helmet sometimes I do sometimes I don't uh, but mostly on my own quiet horses that have uh, thousands of hours of training I choose not to that's my choice I'm not going to get after you uh, or tease you for wearing a helmet and if somebody teases me when I wear a helmet I don't care okay it's my choice my feeling my gut okay so before you want to make any comments to me about how risky it is and how uh, you're going to have to pay to take care of me uh, if something should happen to me, um, I want to ask you a few questions, okay, or what kind of behavior that you participate in. So my question uh, would be, do you participate in... Uh, unprotected I don't even want to say it, but you know what I'm talking about all right and um, we'll have multiple partners okay that's risky behavior uh, do you ski uh, do you do anything like walk out of your back uh, the back door of your house front door of your house in the winter time okay that's very risky uh, snow and ice I've fallen down uh, and hurt myself more than I've uh, ever come off a horse and uh, now because of that I wear cleats in the winter time all right um, what else do you uh, smoke all right uh, used to I give it up very unhealthy all right do you do you drink do you drink to excess uh, I hope you don't drink and drive have you ever text and drive not only are you risking your life, but you're risking taking somebody else out. And um, I hope you don't ever text and drive. Um, so there's many risky behaviors that people participate in um, that you could be getting after them or your own self, okay, before you try uh, think about looking down on me for not donning a helmet, okay. I could look down on you, perhaps, if you... Uh, have it put in your time and train in your horse um, to stand at the mountain block, okay? So try not to criticize. Um, life is dangerous, okay? Anything can happen. And um, people get on horses that don't stand to be mounted, that are jiggy, that have no brakes. 
people do this all the time and they have a helmet on so they're like look at me i'm wearing a helmet i'm safer than you okay that's not the case it's not even close okay anything can happen my horse can trip and fall um anything can happen and uh but i also uh i don't like wearing a helmet i know it inhibits it has to inhibit some type form of um, balance vision okay because i've hit my head wearing a helmet or a cowboy hat going into my trailer okay not my new trailer uh going into my chicken house okay that doesn't ever happen when i don't have a helmet on so something right there is a problem uh and your vision okay um and and uh, it it does affect it um most definitely and uh, the helmet strap can grab if you're in thick woods uh real real uh you know going off the beaten path and i have i know people that have gotten grabbed and taken right off their horse from a branch getting caught in that helmet strap so um anything can happen so stack the odds in your favor and um be safe everybody um Thank you very much for listening.